What's going on guys and welcome to this review of second in form Destro and Ultimate Team. Destro of course the Roma striker that plays in the Serie A and is Italian as well. I picked him up for 18,000 coins and he does have the marksman chemistry style which improves his uh, dribbling, shooting and heading. Three star skills, three star weak foot, high and medium work rates and he also does have as you can see here a goals to game ratio for me of 13 goals in 12 games so very very good. Now he's 5 foot 11 Destro but his key physical stats for me were 82 acceleration, uh, Jumping 87 and sprint speed 82 and reactions 88. Uh, mental stat, the key stat for me was uh, attacking position 78, but also aggression 79. His key skill stat for me was finishing 95 uh, and also shot power, which is uh, down below here, is uh, 90 as well. And volleys 87, if you will, and heading accuracy 81. Uh, to be honest, second informed Destro, I did break it into two parts, which is shooting and heading. Now, I kind of was hoping that I could have three parts and also passing for second informed. Destro, but to be honest, the way I used Destro was just as a poacher, as someone who gets the goals. Now, I originally had second in form Destro playing in a 3 5 2, which meant he had a strike partner, and that partner was Balotelli. But after I changed to playing in a uh, 4 3 2 1, that meant he was playing on his own. I mean, there was obviously Tarat in the left forward and Quad Quadrado in right forward, which meant he yeah, did have two players up there with him supporting him. But uh, in general, he was the main and sole striker, and that's why I didn't really pass the ball with him that much. Much, which is why I couldn't really include that part of the review because there'd only be like one or two clips and it wouldn't really showcase his talents. But to be honest, at the end of the day, you're probably looking at second in form Destro. You want him as a striker, you want him to score those goals. And I have to say right now, he's probably the most clinical striker I've used in this year's Ultimate Team. He was fantastic. And as you can see here, he doesn't even get out muscled very easy at all. You see Kabul's trying to take him off the ball here, but he can't do so. And uh, his finishing being 95 is just absolutely fantastic. Basically, if you <laughs> shoot with him and you don't put you know a ridiculous amount of power on it you're probably going to hit the target I can't remember the last time I took a shot with him and the ball didn't test the goalkeeper he was so clinical every single time he went one-on-one -on -one, he looked like he was going to score a goal for me and of course those three star skill moves were quite nice as well so I could put a couple of ball rolls and reverse step overs in there as well uh, just for a bit of fun but uh, his volleys like I said he scored one volley that was this one it was pretty nice to be honest Quadrado chipped it into field and uh, it was a nice technique on his right foot there past the keeper and uh, he also scored one penalty for me which is why I didn't pick out his penalty stat because it was only one I didn't really see the point to be honest but he only took one penalty but he scored it as well but uh, yeah his shooting was fantastic his finishing was incredible I can't speak highly enough for his finishing and also he his heading as well. This is the second part of the review. As I said, his heading, the reason I picked out jumping and heading, he may be 5 foot 11 and for some people that may not be too tall for a striker, but the amount of headers he won was absolutely ridiculous. You know, he comes up against centre-backs like David Luiz and, and uh, Benatia and centre-backs like that that are very very hard to beat in the air, but the amount of headers he won surprised me so much. He rarely ever got out jumped and whenever he did win the header, he tend to get it on target and usually he would find the back of the net 9 times out 10 as well so not only his finishing was very good but his heading was fantastic as well now like I said I picked him up for 18,000 coins and I gotta be honest that is an absolute steal if you're thinking about picking up Destro for an Italian side or a Serie A side or both uh, I would definitely recommend picking his second in form up because he was absolutely fantastic never used his in form never used his regular card but his second in form was for 18,000 coins an absolute steal definitely worth picking out like I said he wasn't a striker that was a target man or a creator but as a finisher, as a poacher, you really can't get much better than second in form Destro. I thought he was absolutely fantastic and I definitely do recommend picking up because for 18,000 coins, probably even cheaper now, for 18,000 coins he is worth every single coin. But uh, as always guys, big thank you for watching this review. I really hope you have enjoyed it. If you have enjoyed the review, please let me know in the comments and please leave a like as well. Also, if you can, please leave a comment and tell me who you'd like to see me review next. I'd definitely like to check out your suggestions and uh, yeah, let me know in the comments who you'd like to see me review next. So thanks for watching, leave a like if you enjoyed and I'll see you for another informed review very soon.